Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. How's everybody doing today? Hopefully you're doing pretty good. I myself, I'm okay. I'm okay, I'm just hanging out. It's me, my kitties, and my new rhino here. Say hi to the rhino. It's a rhino. That's actually a good screenshot. Snap. Um, this is the woolly rhino that we got last episode. Miss Stabby Face. Yep, that's what I called her. Miss Stabby Face. So, Miss Stabby Face here. Stab. Stab. Blah. Kind of actually... has replaced a few of our dinos. Because... Really, where where is the need for... You know, a mammoth... When... You got this crazy sprinting guy... Who can just... Go absolutely nuts on all the plants... And... Just get all the berries. I mean, the mammoth has more weight capacity, but I'm getting it up there. So, in between episodes, we've had a few changes. Mostly in the form of... Cat's been real busy painting. Gate, gate, ah, stuck. Cat's been busy painting everything and everyone. Like, most of the dinosaurs have gotten a paint job, and pretty much all of the house has gotten a paint job. So, like, all our wolves, they've all got paint jobs. The Pteranodon... That actually doesn't have a paint job yet. Uh, Pretzel Quetzel. There you go, there's a Pteranodon. Another one. Argentavis. Ooh, Argentavis egg. Don't mind if I do. Got ourselves a little patchy. These little head button guys. Uh... But yeah, she's been painting up a storm. And it's looking pretty cool. Ish, pretty cool indeed. We got this room, which is kind of a little bit white. Ah. I stuck. So yeah, she's been doing a pretty awesome job. Not quite done, and, and we're doing a little bit of renovating. <laughs> um, yeah, there's a couple of plans in the work. We're not quite sure about them yet. Um, but... What are you doing in the kitchen? Get out of the kitchen. What I'm wanting to do today... Oh, by the way, artifacts! Um, they make great decorations. And that's kind of what I was hoping to be able to do today. Um, but I kind of need... I don't need, but I want help. And as you can see, the kitty cat is offline. And she's not responding to my Skype. So, whatever. I'm on my own. That's fine. What I want to do... Um, first off, I guess, is put this stuff in the fridge before it expires. Why is there a whole bunch of random berries in here? We don't need all of those. Anyway, uh, as you can see, I've got full riot gear now. It's just the primitive stuff, except for the pants, because those were blueprint. 
Um, we've got the engrams to spare, and there's always mind wipe, and we figured, hey, let's check it out. So we're wearing flak. Not flak. Riot. Ish pretty cool. It's a little expensive, but, uh, I've got a decent amount of polymer left, and a whole bunch of cementing paste, and... We're playing out with the electric prod and the fabricated sniper rifle, which sucks. Um, I don't mind its damage. Its durability is what sucks. What you see there is maybe like 30 shots. Like, really? 30 shots? Come on, Arc devs. What kind of firearm in any reality fires maybe... 50 bullets, 40 maybe, I don't know, and then breaks? I have never seen a gun do that before. I don't know what kind of firing range you guys go to, but they got some crappy tools. And I don't know what part of the world you're in, but while we're on the topic of weird numbers, temperature... Yeah, I should not be getting hypothermia at minus 11. Like, if I go into the Arctic, it's like, Oh no, it's minus 10, it's minus 11, it's minus 14! Oh, you're freezing! I live in Canada, where frequently we hit minus 40 Celsius. Which equals the same thing in Fahrenheit. So it's minus 40 Fahrenheit. And guess what? We don't freeze to death. We just put on a coat and suck it up. Anyway. Anyway. One of the things that I forgot about was this guy. The preserving bin. I was like, I was going to add those to the kitchen. And then I forgot. And now I don't really have the room for them. Which is kind of my bad. Oops. But I want some of them. What category are they in? Fridges. Yeah, let's craft eight of them. No. We're only going to go with two for right now. And I kind of had this idea of do I have the wooden walkway I don't know if the walkway is going to be thick enough but like we have these oh, catwalks sorry not walkway if we can grab a couple of those I was thinking what we could do is Oh no. Right, they want to snap at that height. Oh, I wish I could like do it halfway in cuz like if I could have it down and in I I don't know, I had this vision of the the preserving bin above the fridges. I guess that won't work. That's fine. That's fine. It's all good. It's all good. Um I could put them right here instead of the campfires. Because, really... Why, why would I need campfires? I'm going to cook food. I'm going to cook it in bulk with the industrial grill. How much beer do I have? I got 10 beer. Beer. And if I'm making charcoal, I've got the cooking pots. So, that does kind of make sense that we are going to get rid of the campfires. Goodbye. So sad. Now, are these... Nice textures, but get... Oh, look, it's my butt. Get... Okay. 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 Good enough? It's not what I wanted. What slots it in? Eight. Of course, I'm not going to be able to get this one. 
Oh man, I don't think I can get that in K mode. I think I gotta try and be all fancy. We'll see if I can get it. Let's see if I can get it. A little, a little straighter. Ta da, ta da. Ta da. That looks pretty smooth to me. That looks pretty smooth. Um, why are we adding these? For jerky, of course. It's the only reason to keep them these days. Um, I mean, all this jerky, uh, it's used in making kibble. 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 And we need kibble. We do. For those marvelous, perfect tames that, you know, prime meat just, can, it, it, it kind of can, but, you know, like, it, it's kind of hard to get prime meat all the time. Every time you're taming something, or for the herbivores, you want the kibble. Now, the specific kibble I'm going for right now, unfortunately, I've only got the two eggs. I want the Palmetto Scorpius kibble, because I want another T-Rex. Why might you ask I want another T-Rex? Well, for starters, why not? Uh, secondly, just... It's a request. Cat has requested that she wants another T-Rex. And by the way, all glory to the Hypnotoad. Um, so Glacier here, he's our guy. He's our male T-Rex. So we need to find a female T-Rex. But I'm kind of wanting a higher level one, because Glacier is 133. And I can't remember exactly what level he was when I found him. But I think he was only like a 90-something. Or an 80-something. I don't know. I want a higher level one. And that, I want kibble for. So I need scorpions. And I've only got Widow here. The one scorpion. Yeah, Widow's all lonely. Can't you just see? There, now can't you just see how lonely Widow is? Oh, oh. That's a really weird attack. Like, that goes over my head. Like, what happens if the scorpion, like, just stung me in the back of the neck? You're scary. So, yes. I want to get myself some more scorpions. So that I can get those marvelous, marvelous little eggs. And holy crap, I have a lot of narcotics. Where is my tranks? They're on pretzel. There they are. So yes, uh, we don't actually need to use pretzel. We can just grab one of the Argentavis. Probably Krenye, who's gotten a new paint job. Um... I'm not so sure I like that paint job. I might erase that. You know what? I, I, I don't like that paint job. So we're going to go with Fionn. Who's got the wings of rainbows. It's also our faster flyer anyway, so that's cool. And we're going to find ourselves any old scorpions. I don't care about the level. Because... All as long as I have one male. And look, I found a male. As long as there's one male and a bunch of females, they're going to lay eggs. We're going to get this going. So, I am going to get these all brought over. Okay, well, it's finally getting lighter out. And the fog went away. And we got a couple of scorpions. So... It got really, really bad. Like, I couldn't see. Even with Gamma, even, you know, even I couldn't see. I mean, YouTube will compress it and make it, like, really, really crappy. But, like, even on my screen, nice high def, I still couldn't see. Because it was nighttime and it was fog. And it's just, brr, this game and it's nighttime fog. Anyway. The lobies here shouldn't take uh, shouldn't take too many shots. You might take a couple.
Pass out. Pass out. I mean, I don't care about perfect team or anything like that. There we go. Look at that. It's a plethora of scorpions on unconscious. I'm just trying to make an egg farm. So there we go. Those guys should all tame up. I hope their torpor won't drop too fast. I mean, they're low level, and of course, low level means very little torpor, which means it drops. But we'll see. It also means they don't need to eat that much. So I'm hoping that they'll just tame up in my absence. If not, I'll just knock them out again. But I kind of want to go get more scorpions now that it's light out. Alrighty. Well, it's going to take a little bit to get those pulmono scorpius eggs. So I figured I'd come check out some drops under the ocean. Me and Finnegan here. So we had just been hanging out searching for drops. And lo and behold, looky what I find. But a Dunkleo Dunkleosteus? Dunkleosteus? So it's only level 15. Which, you know, is, is, that's actually really kind of crappy. Ain't hey, level 15? Really? Really? But at the same time, you know what? I kind of want one. Just to see what they're like. Just to say I have one, right? And... Why are you on passive? Alright, well... I have no clue why it's on passive. Uh, follow. I hear these guys have one heck of a bite. So let's try and avoid its bite. And we have it down. Unconscious. Alrighty. Now, where's Finnegan? Ah, there you are. Come here, shark bait. Brouhaha. Let's get some meat in ya. Get you some primes. Oh, hi Finnegan. Thanks for defending me. You're such a champion. Yeah, this thing needs to tame. This thing needs to tame now. I mean, it's, it's not the food timers, it's my health. Because, like, it's, it's very cold here. Oh, there it goes. Aha, it was only one bite. Yay, I got a donkey. Okay, Finnegan. Finnegan, let, let me ride. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh, -ho. hello. Hello, pretty. What have you for me? Oh, oh my. Oh, oh my indeed. It, it's primitive. Uh, which, you know, kind of sucks, but it also kind of guarantees that I'll be able to craft it. But a Mosasaur Platform Saddle Blueprint. Blueprint. I don't even have a Mosa. And that's just... That's amazing. That's absolutely amazing. <laughs> wow. Uh, that was the first drop I found. That was... That... <laughs> Oh man, there's still 
like a ton to search. That was like number four on my circle. Wow. Definitely wow. I like that blue one. That's like a really cool blue. Oh, ow. ow. You're back. Aha, it is unconscious. Fin oh, oh, cheaper, that's a plesiosaur. Apparently we weren't high enough. That is a really cool looking plesiosaur. I wonder what level it is. 35. Okay. Damn, that guy turns fast. You can either die or get unconscious, please. One or the other. Preferably unconscious, because it'd be cool to have a plesiosaur. Oh, that's the world border. Ouch! Oh, it's fins went limp. It's fins went limp. Is it unconscious? It's unconscious! Oh, wow. Oh, wow, Finnegan. Oh, wow. Oh, do you, you don't have any primes. You, you don't even have any primes. We need to get primes. 
Hey, is this little angler still unconscious too? Yeah, but not for much longer. That's okay. I've got narcotics. Here, have some narcotics. Uh, have a few stacks of meat. I mean, you're level three. You're just, you're just a cute little pet. That's all I'm taming you for. Cute little pet. That's it. Okay, you team up. Where's the pleasy? He's way up there. Okay. I need to find, like, a megalodon or something. I need to find something to chew on. Did I really find, like, the deadest o part of the ocean ever? Bunch of anglerfish and one plesiosaur. Okay, it's still unconscious for a good long time. How about you? You're okay. Come on, where's a megalodon? Anything. Another plesiosaur. Can do. Let's add a whole bunch of regular meat, because that prime ain't going to last long. Holy crap, that tamed a lot, though. I mean, it is only level 35. No, get away. Oh, I hope I didn't hit him. Did I hit you? Nope, good. I mean, not that the bonus is really like that huge, but like, I'd rather not lose what little bonus I can get. If I don't have to. You should team with those two. This.
Oh, there goes the angler. Yes. Okay, cool. I can ride him now. Yay, I'm riding an angler fish. You're so cute. Alright. How are you doing? You're almost done because you're super low level. So, it looks like I'm going to have to head back to base. Because, <laughs> like hell am I leaving my anglerfish and my new plesiosaur out in the wild while I go and look for drops. So, the only drop I got was the platform, mostly sort of plot platform saddle. Yay, it's a plesiosaur. Nice. Very, very nice. I mean, yes, they're low levels. I mean, you know, the angler is literally level four. It's level four. I don't care. I don't care. I have an angler fish. It's cool. I mean, for a level four, it can carry 350 pounds. That ain't bad. That ain't bad. What's your stats like? You're only a level 52. 52, that's it. You're a little lobby. But look at you, 800 pounds, 2,000 some health. Jeepers, I can only imagine what a higher level pleasey would have. Man, oh man. I don't know why I'm finding all the low level guys today, but I'm not going to complain too strenuously. I mean, sure, they're not the greatest, but... You know, it's it's still new stuff. It's still just cool to have. I mean, Finnegan here is level 206. Uh, compare that to these guys, uh, Finnegan wins. But, come on. You know, it was a pleasy by itself. And I've always wanted an angler fish, because ever since I learned you could ride them... So there we go, guys. Our new pets. And I think that should about do it for today. That'll about do it. We're about done. The thing is just kind of hanging out my nose. Look at that. Um, yeah. That'll about do it for today. We got ourselves a bunch of scorpions for eggs, so that we can get ourselves a great rex once we find it. Yeah. We got ourselves this awesome, awesome blueprint. It's primitive, but that's okay. It's a platform saddle for a mosasaur. Yeah. And then we got the cool plesiosaur. And we got a little anglerfish. We got a little anglerfish. Yay! Yay for the little anglerfish. He's nice and bright blue. My favorite color. My favorite color. It's a blue. It's a blue. So, they're not that high levels, but oh well. I like them. They're mine. They are mine. Oh, hey, you're so, you're so ugly. You've got a lot of teeth. Holy crap. So, yeah, guys. Give me those thumbs up. Give up, give up the thumbs for the plesiosaur and the angler and the scorpions and yay. <laughs> All right, guys. Leave those thumbs up. Leave the comments. And if you're not already, make sure to subscribe. And I'll catch you guys next time. Bye-bye.